pay in time watch when I'm back. Okay? God says, Honor your father and mother, your days may be long on earth. Which the Lord your God has given you. But yet, we have a government that says, if you want to turn her in, if you want to turn him or her in for spanking you, turn them in. I mean, what the hell is that? I mean, what's wrong with... The Bible says, spare the rod, spoil the child. I mean, just because you tan their hide for being smart-mouthed to you does not make you wrong. God's Word says you can discipline your children. But the government says, give me a call. If they go to whip you with a belt, we'll lock them up. Everything I'm telling you is the truth. That's why end time watchmen almost pukes and throws up whenever I hear a congressman, a senator, or the president, any of them, try to speak like they are something that's supposed to help you. They are, are nothing but, but filthy garbage that you better run from and you better not bow to, buddy. And I'm giving you Bible scripture. And I know, hey, I know that if I was preaching this in Europe or Canada right now, they'd be coming to get me. I'm not in Canada. I ain't in Europe. I'm in the good old USA because I still got my freedom for the moment, but it's soon to be gone. Because remember the videos I made I pulled down? Look, when I see, look, listen. When I see garbage just getting 10,000 hits and 20,000 hits after being up there in no time, and then I preach my heart out for the Word of God to try to put the truth out, and I see after a month I've only got 12 to 1,500, what's the point in leaving it there? What's the point? All I'm doing is, 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 is endangering my children, my wife, for what I'm saying and trying to put out the truth. What's the point in leaving it up there? You put the Word of God out, you put the truth out, and by gosh, if it takes them two months to look at it while they look at that other garbage, so be it. Let them not hear it. I've had it with trying to put the truth out, and nobody wants to listen. You are supposed to honor your father and your mother. You are supposed to respect them when they say, stay your A-double-S at home. Don't go out and get drunk or screw around. Wait till you're married. You're supposed to honor what they say. But I see time after time at a grocery store, in town, whatever, they are just talking down and bad-mouthing their mom and daddy. They, by God, better be glad they don't belong in time. They'd have never got that far with that crap. Because I'd have tore their tail up. You understand me? Their butt wouldn't have held shut because I'd have tore it up with a belt. And I, by God, I know some government officials, they need their A-double-S's whipped too. Because by God, if they'd have been brought up under discipline and had a belt put on their tail and said, this is right and this is wrong, we wouldn't be in the shape we're in today. Don't make me preach this tonight. But you go ahead. You do your little time out crap. You do your little other stuff and just go ahead and let them become, become just uh, unhinged because that's the way it is today. But as for me and my house, we'll serve God and not the government. What about you? Let's move on. Mm -hmm. Whoa. It says right here in my Bible, you shall not murder. Well, wait a minute now. Let me translate it for you. You shall not murder. In other words, do not shed innocent blood, saith God, Christian person, Christian preacher. But yet, Obama just passed, the government's been passed since Roe versus Wade, that abortion on demand, kill all them innocent kids. God says don't shed innocent blood. The government says kill them all. Nancy Pelosi and Obama says to kill the babies would be an economic stimulus. We ain't got to feed as many. Go look it up. I'm not playing no trash. Which I know this won't go far. I know it won't. 
It's not going to go far. My videos don't get out. They're censored and everything else. But here's the thing. By God have mercy on my soul. I have put the truth. To a lost and dying nation that's headed to hell in a handbasket. And they don't have to listen. But I have to put it out there. That's my calling. But they don't have to listen. But thank God in heaven. That my butt don't have to burn in hell with them. Thank God in heaven I didn't compromise. And go along with the status quo. Like so many are. I can stand before God when He calls my soul. And I can know that I told the truth about it. Regardless of how wild it seems in today's generation. There's no way this redneck with the hat on can be telling the truth. I've heard from all the media and the government that this is the way to walk in it. But here he's telling me totally different. Well, I tell you what you do. You make your choice watching this video. Do I believe my government? Do I believe my friends? Do I believe my church? Or do I believe the Word of God? Yes, sir, buddy. That's what you got to ask yourself. Because I got news for you. Shedding innocent blood and murdering babies is wrong. Stealing money from old folks where they can't pay their bills and they starve to death or they in a nursing home somewhere and they die when they shouldn't have died is wrong. Oh, yeah. The Bible says don't murder, which means shed innocent blood. See, now, on the other hand, if they somebody breaking down my door to get my kids and my wife, I can pop a cap in them and feel good about it. And hope it's winter time where they won't stink. Because I ain't bothering burying them. And God's pleased with that. But see, we're so confused, so mixed up. And I'll say it again. This is how stupid and backwards America is. You ready? You park in your driveway and you drive on a parkway. Why in the hell do they name it a parkway when you're driving on the parkway and you're supposed to be parked. Why in the hell do they call it a driveway when you pull up in there and park in it? Can we not get the names right? Can we not put the nomenclature specifically on what part of this asphalt that this is supposed to be? No. It's all backwards. End time watchman will be right back.